with breast conservation or lumpectomy in layman's terms, uh, we have irradiated the entire breast. That usually takes about six weeks. Uh, but now over the last, oh, nearly decade, there's been the development of the big machines that do the radiation therapy into portable machines called mobile linear accelerators so that these can be brought to the operating room where the surgeons are working. And there are two ways that we can use the intraoperative radiation therapy when we're doing our surgery. One of the ways is to do what's called the boost therapy. This is where we're irradiating right where the cancer was in the breast after, of course, the cancer has been taken out. And this saves the radiation therapist about a week's worth of therapy uh, that, that they would do externally, where the, the uh, electrons are coming through the breast itself. Um, so that's one way of using it. Another way, which has been far more used in Europe, is be able to use the radiation therapy as a what is called a single fraction, a single dose in the operating room for smaller tumors, better acting tumors, one, one radiation therapy in the OR, that's it. In the United States, we're waiting for some major reports from Europe to see how widely that technology may be adopted here. So the idea is to be able to go from six weeks in certain patients down to one time in the OR, or to be able to go from six weeks down to five weeks by doing the boost, if you will, in the OR. And then another new treatment that's just here and coming, in fact, at my hospital now is to do that boost I was telling you about in the operating room, followed by three weeks of radiation therapy, which is what is done in Canada. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.